You may pause the video and try this first. This problem is from 2012, and simply we got this situation going on here. A person whose height is six, so let me just draw on top of this picture here. So this guy is six, and he's walking away from the base of a street light along a straight path at a rate of four feet per second. So from here to here, that distance increases four feet per second. So I'm gonna call that, um, the length of it is called x. That means dx over dt. This is related rates, by the way. The rate at which x increases as time ticks, it's four feet per second. Okay, and then we have a simple right triangle here. Okay, so we're given that the street light is 15. So this is 15 feet and the person's shadow let's call let's call that y then we're we're told to find what the rate at which the person's shadow is lengthening so dy dt is what we're looking for okay so whenever you have these uh triangle within a triangle like this it's it creates two similar triangles so we got big triangle here I draw separately big triangle and then inside of it let me uh, trace this with green inside of it right here we have a little triangle okay those two triangles will always be similar to each other that means corresponding sides are in the same ratio what I mean is that if this is 15 the height of the triangle here the base of the triangle is x plus y for the little triangle, if the height is 6, this base will be y. So let's set up a ratio here. So we got 15 over x plus y equals 6 over y. Make sure that everything's corresponding. We got height to the base of the triangle is equal to height of the little triangle to the base of a little triangle here. You could set as 15 over 6 is equal to x plus y over y. That's fine too. Let's cross multiply. So we have 15y is going to equal to 6 times x plus y will be 6x plus 6y. Okay, let's move things over. I'm going to subtract 6y over. That creates 9y is equal to 6x. Now, we're given dx dt and we have to find dy dt. Let's just find the uh, derivative, okay? Oops, there we go. So we got nine times, when we take the derivative with respect to t, we're gonna get dy dt is going equal to six times, again, we got dx dt, okay? All we gotta do is plug in numbers now. dx dt is four, right there, that's four. So we got nine times dy dt is going to be equal to 6 times 4. Okay, now solve for dy dt. It's going to be 6 times 4 divided by 9. So when we do that, we're going to get 2 point, so dy dt is 2.6 with a bar on top. Okay, so units will be feet per second. What is that? That's going to be b.